as surveyors, we must work under many different environmental circumstances. Apart from weather conditions, we must find a way to work with obstacles that interfere, or interrupt satellite signals. In this video, we will show how trees can interfere with accurate GPS readings. As we all know, paper is made from the raw material of trees. Trees are 80% wood fiber, and 20% water and salt. In today's video, we will use paper and water to simulate how a tree can interfere with a GNSS receiver getting an accurate reading through a satellite signal. eSurvey Products is one of the most accurate GNSS products on the market. We are proud of the accuracy and power of our receivers. eSurvey Products are lightweight, easy to use and has multi-communication function. We are using this experiment as a way to demonstrate to you, our customer, just how accurate and dependable our GNSS receivers are. First, we will set up the GNSS receiver in a glass encasement. We will then establish our first point. Then, we will stake out the same point to show the quality of the reading. Then, I will cover the top of the receiver with my hand to cut the satellite signal. Now, I'll take my hand off the receiver, and the signal will return to the fixed point. Next, I will put one ream, or 500 sheets of standard copy paper, on the glass encasement over the receiver. As you can see, there is no change in the value or quality of the stakeout. So I will add another 200 sheets of paper. Still, no change. I will add another 300 sheets of paper. Still, no change. Finally, I will add 200 more sheets. This time there is a change in the value. A 1 cm error. For the second part of the experiment, we will put a glass cake pan over the receiver. We will pour about 1 cm of water into the pan. You will notice there is a 1 cm error because the water is moving. The satellite signal is being reflected in the ripples of the water. Once the water is still, the reading will return to fixed point. Now, we will add more water, up to 5 cm. As you can see, while the water is moving, the error reading will be 5 cm. But as you see, as the water becomes still, the reading will return to fixed point. But even if the instrument did show an error of 5 cm, this accuracy is still okay for surveying work. Thank you for dropping by, we enjoyed setting up this experiment to show you the power and accuracy of eSurvey products.